Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing another review. Today I'm going to be doing a makeup review. So recently Prestige um, has contacted me and was wondering if I would like to try out some of their products and possibly do a video on them. And like I have said before, I am not required to do this review. I am not forced to say good things about the product. They just wanted to know if I was interested in trying them and maybe telling you guys what I thought of them. So my opinions are completely 100% honest as usual. So I will tell you when I like a product, I will tell you when I don't like it. Okay, so the Total Intensity line debuted last year and it's now expanded to jumbo eyeshadow pencils, lip pencils, and more eyeshadow colors. So I was really excited to try out this line. It's very pigmented and bright and that is the idea of it. Okay, so Prestige is available on their website, um, prestigecosmetics.com. It's also available in stores at Dwayne Reed, Rite Aid, and Ulta. So I'm gonna be going over the products that they sent me and my thoughts on them. I am wearing one of the products now. So I will start off with the eyeshadow pencils. Okay, so these are called the Total Wear Eyeshadow Sticks and these I love the concept of. I love shadow sticks because you can put them on as a thick liner and blend them out to create a really soft, smoky effect. Now today I am wearing the one in the color um, Meteorite and I have worn this one a lot. It's this gorgeous taupe color and it has a little bit of a metallic uh, sheen to it. So I love this color. I'm wearing it all over my lid today and it's a great color. It's very pigmented um, and it lasts really well. So I wore this kind of on the lid and smudged it out and then I just put one shadow on top of it and it creates a super fast, soft, smoky eye. So I'm a big fan of this color. Now the other colors they sent me, I probably won't wear as much, but they're still gorgeous. The next color is in Desert Delusion and this is a very pretty copper color. As you can see, again, it's super pigmented and it has that gorgeous metallic reflection to it. The next color is Blue Moon. It's this really awesome deep navy. And this would be great for a dark blue smoky eye. And I love the sheen that they have to them. So this would be so pretty, kind of used as a liner and smudged out. You could tone it down. So I'm so excited to wear this one. I think this is gonna be a really unique color. Now, as far as these three go, they are super pigmented. The only thing I wish is maybe they glided on a little bit easier since the eye area is such a sensitive area, but it's not like they are not pigmented. They're super pigmented. The formula is just, um, it's not quite like the Urban Decay glide on pencils that are super smooth when you put them on. These are just a little bit drier, but they're not bad at all. I mean, they're super pigmented still, and you don't have to swipe a ton to get them on. Um, which is nice. They do blend really easily though, which I love. So these I can see myself getting a lot of use out of. I love these shadow sticks and I think it makes it really wearable to wear like a blue because you can line it really close to the lashes and just smudge it out. Um, or you can use this taupe as a liner or all over the lid and or under shadows to make your shadows last longer. So these are great and these are definitely one of my favorite out of the products that they sent me. Okay, so keeping with the eyes, I'm going to move on to the um, True Metals eyeshadows. Now, they are, they sent me three colors. Um, they sent me copper, um, bronze, and silver. So I love metallics and they're super on trend for fall. Um, now my favorite I'm gonna start off with is the bronze color, or I guess, the one that I would wear the most because I really like the two other. I'm just really comfortable with bronze colors. Now this is the bronze one. These are crazy, crazy pigmented. And again, this is with no primer on. That is the bronze. So you can see how pigmented it is, but it, ooh, see that was a, a smudge swatch and it just was so pigmented. It's super reflective and I think this would just be so gorgeous all over the lid. See there, you can really see the true color, but the light is just catching off my hand like crazy right now because they have this gorgeous, like true metallic shine to them. So this fall, metallics are really in and it's hard to find a metallic that really has that reflection to it and these really do. So the next one is copper. And I love a good copper smoky eye that's super warm, blended all around the eye. It's a little bit, um, I would say bronze is probably the most wearable, but copper is so pretty on green eyes and blue eyes because it really brings out um, the orange tones, really bring out those cooler eye colors. But I love copper too. Now this one 
has it's like a bronze but has more red in it so that's the difference between copper and bronze if you were wondering so it looks like a penny so I'm going to put that one right by the bronze so you can see it's still very pretty very pigmented but it has a little bit more of that red undertone as a copper would and it looks like a penny on your eyes it's so pretty and I love the warmth that it gives an eye look and uh, this paired with some brown liner or black liner in the waterline and just really blended out would be beautiful for fall. Okay, the next one is silver. And this is a very light, bright silver, like a true silver. It's not like a dark gunmetal color, which um, I really love too. Um, so I'm wondering if they do have a darker one, which I would like to pair with this. But this one is super pretty. Uh, I will give you, it's super pigmented. This reminds me a lot of Electra from MAC but it's actually way more pigmented than my MAC one. The MAC one is great, but you have to pack on more of it to get the same effect. This one is pigmented the first swatch. And again, you can see how reflective it is. It almost looks like white on my hand. So again, it just has a beautiful sheen to it. And this would be so pretty um, to do like a gunmetal smoky eye with and have this in the center to really pop. And for the holidays, I think this is gonna be so pretty to do like an icy silver look with. Now that I have eyeshadow all over my hands. Okay, so moving on to the Total War Lip Crayons, I have three colors to show you guys. Um, the first color that I have worn, and I think I posted a picture of it on Instagram, is in Wine Knot. And I love wine colors. I gotta figure out a place to swatch these here. I'm gonna swatch them here. Now this one is a very dark berry color. It's, um, I think it's very wearable and I love it. It's got a brightness to it, um, so it's not super vampy and dark. It has a very pink, purpley undertone. It does have a slight glitter in it. Now that's the only thing I wasn't too fond about. At first when I put it on, I was like, oh, this is so pretty. My lips are shimmering. But throughout the day, when the product wears off, it leaves a little bit of a grittiness to your lips, which I'm not a big fan of. But they go on so smooth and they do last really well. So that's the only thing I feel like glitter can kind of feel weird as it starts to wear off. As the color starts to wear off, you start to feel the glitter in the product more. So that's the only complaint about this color, but the color is gorgeous. Gorgeous. So the next one is berry with me and this is more of a brighter pink berry color the other one has more plum in it so this one I love too this is probably my favorite one as you can see on camera they don't look too different but this one is definitely um, a deeper redder toned wine berry and this one has a lot more brightness and pink to it now this one doesn't have the same glitter this one's creamier and I think it's actually even more pigmented which I love it's just very bold and bright so this one I think is gonna be the one that I'm wearing a lot and I think it's a great color when you want to do something deeper but that still has that brightness to it that's not like a vampy dark lip so this one is my favorite and then the last one is a girl on fire and this one is like an reddish orange color and now this one I am interested to try out. I'm usually, I'm just gonna put this swatch right here. I don't wear a ton of orange and corals, which I want to try more of. I usually stick more towards the cooler reds because they make your teeth look white. But orange is super on trend. And it's, it's coming off a little more brick toned on camera, but this is a very, very bright orange red. And this is, again, very creamy finish. This doesn't have any glitter in it. These do have shine to them, but this does not have any glitter. The wine color is the one with a little bit of glitter. So these feel very creamy. They stay creamy on the lips. They don't dry out your lips as you wear them. So overall, I like the Girl on Fire and the Berry, um, the Berry with me the best. Now, overall, as a product, these are crazy pigmented for being a drugstore product. Um, is something I haven't seen in drugstore lip pencils, which I have liked, they tend to be more sheer. So I think it is great that Prestige came out with such a bold pigmented line. These shadow pencils are amazing quality. They remind me of, again, like the Urban Decay ones, very similar, um, or the Laura Mercier Caviar Sticks. These give the same color payoff and these are a fraction of the price. Okay, so overall, the Prestige Total Intensity line is right up my alley. Very bold, pigmented colors, and great colors for fall. So this is definitely something I would recommend. I would definitely say my favorites would have to be the Metallic Shadows 
in the copper or the bronze, the meteor meteorite shadow stick, and then probably the berry with me lip pencil but I love them all so I hope you guys enjoyed this review let me know if you guys like reviews and let me know if you try out any of these new prestige products I think they are gonna look great on so many skin tones because they have a good variety of warm and cool so check out my blog for more pictures and follow me on Instagram to stay up to date let me know what videos you guys want to see next or what other new products you want me to try out I hope you guys have an awesome day and I will see you in my next video bye Hello and I'm feeling fly It's hot with the sunny sky We laugh out like every night We can do what we want to